Well, I've been leading on border security. I represent a border district, and because of my leadership on this, I've got the endorsement of the 15,000 Border Patrol agents, uh, the border ranchers, and also the Angel families, uh, those who no longer have a family member with them because there's been someone here illegally who is a violent criminal uh, who killed them. And so I hope the voters who care deeply about border security because of the opioid crisis, the trafficking, this should be a unifying issue, would really take a look at my record uh, and see that I'm going to continue to lead on border security to keep our country and community safe. Well, we're talking to every voter. Uh, we've got three days to go and we're engaging all over the state and we want to make sure everybody understands what my record is and they know who I am and why I fight, fight for our country. I've spent my life fighting for America and fighting for Arizona now in Congress and I'd ask everybody to just get engaged, get off the sidelines. If you're happy about the economy, the job opportunities, uh, a strong military, support to Davis Monthan, saving the A-10, the Cherry Bell postal processing facility, the Douglas Port of Entry, those are the things that I've been leading on. And so this is a historic opportunity for us to have our second senator from Southern Arizona ever in our history. Someone who lives in Southern Arizona, someone who's going to fight for Southern Arizona. And so I'd be honored to have their vote. Well, I'm going to continue to lead on national security and military issues. I'm going to continue to advocate for our troops, for Davis Monthan, Luke, Fort Huachuca, all of the amazing national security assets that we have. We need to rebuild our military and strengthen it, but we also need to secure our borders. So I'm going to continue to lead on border security to make sure that we keep our country and our community safe. Okay. Anything else you'd like to add? I'm absolutely honored to represent Southern Arizona in Congress, and I'd be honored to represent Southern Arizona in the Senate. I'd be honored to have their vote. Okay, and how are you feeling feeling right now in your <laughs> final push here? We're feeling good. We've got a lot of strong enthusiasm. We're engaging with every voter, trying to make sure that they get off the sidelines. And if they really care about the direction of the future of our country, we're showing amazing economic opportunity for everybody. We're lifting people out of poverty, again, securing our border, supporting our military. These are the things that I represent Southern Arizona with right now, and I would be honored to continue to serve in the Senate. Okay. We're good. Thanks. Thank you.